what you guys did cypher fortnite added the mk7 and the combat assault rifle for a limited time this weekend and at the end of the weekend on the 5th of april we're going to be voting on which one stays so today i'm going to compare and contrast both weapons and talk about which one i'll be voting for and uh, maybe you guys can make your decision based on today's video keep in mind the combat assault rifle has been changed it is not the same as it was when it was in the game earlier so it, it is it is a little bit stronger if you guys don't know they did nerf the combat smg uh over the past couple days it's still pretty strong and i do think it's better than the stinger still but it got just a slight headshot damage nerf but we missing some shots all good all good That gun does not stop shooting. The MK7, I've got it right here. Let's see how it compares to the burst. Honestly, I'm a huge fan of the burst assault rifle. So I'm not I'm not tripping about the uh Good lord, what the heck are these guys? All right, let's see in action. Oh dude, I don't know, man. That I feel like I would have done more damage with the burst right there. Maybe I'm wrong, but that damage drop off is significant. I still haven't seen the combat AR. I want I want to see how that one feels. I mean, this is obviously just a green one, but 19 damage. Okay, he's gone. 19 damage is very low. I know it's green, but that's still very low. Like a green burst would 100% outperform this thing. I don't know, man. A lot. I saw a lot of people on social media saying they should vote for the MK. I'm not convinced. I know there's only a few shots, but here's the thing. In the no build mode, a lot of the fights are like long range. So like this thing, long range is kind of stinky. No way, man. Like it's, it's got recoil and I feel like the burst really doesn't have hard recoil. I feel like the burst is just better. It does more damage and is more consistent. I'll upgrade this gun though. Well, actually I have enough gold to upgrade a uh, combat. I'm going to upgrade the combat instead of the MK. Cause I kind of already know how the MK is going to feel at gold rarity. It'll shoot straighter and do more damage, but I can, I can already tell like, this is not, this is not the gun to vote for, but let's see if the combat's any better. It might not be combat might feel like the MK just without uh the red dot the burst i know it's like not the easiest gun to get used to but it's like right now with the burst i would have already just beamed that guy i would have beamed him hard and i only just i only did 32 damage right there to him you see he just bursted me once and took off my shields one solid burst the thing is like i know i have relatively decent aim with the burst this gun this gun just it kicks so much it really does kick so much Bro, you see it? He just like turns around, just bursts me once. I'm, I'm losing health. This guy is not losing any health. Using it like an SMG. You see, I mean, you could use the MK like an SMG, but why would you do that? Stinger and the combat SMG and the combat AR are all better close range weapons than the MK. We really thought the MK was good, man. Maybe the mythic version if it came back, but this thing is mid. I'm, I'm, gonna, I'm gonna lose to this guy. Man, let me get that. Let me get that combat AR. I, I haven't seen it yet. I, I'm just going to look, look, I'm going to pick this up just to show you what I'm talking about here. Obviously, that was not a real player, but still trying to like just show you the consistency that I get out of this. And then like for super long range, yeah. this guy, 18, 18, 18. 30 damage per bullet versus the 18 that I'm getting from that range. I know you shoot faster, but you're actually, I feel like I'm missing more with the, uh, with the MK than the burst. Like right here with the burst, you see how that's like 120 damage. If I was using the MK right there, I guarantee you I would have missed. Let's see the blue MK real quick.
Nah, that's just not good. Wow. Good Lord, man. All right, guys. So the MK7, in my opinion, is just not it. It was really weak, way weaker than the burst rifle. It cost me last game because I spent too much time fighting people. Whereas if I had the burst in my hand and I was actually just using the burst, I would have taken them out. So now let's check out the combat because I feel like a lot of people might be thinking that they want to vote for the uh, Ranger. Man, are you really trying to contest me, bro? Not the ranger a lot of people might be wanting to vote for the mk over the combat but let's really take a look at the combat and see see how this thing feels and how it how it how it actually performs there it is like listen listen i know it's not that fair of an assessment because we're, we're turning this one into gold while the mk was green but still like i i could feel the green mk like it was not it Already, already I'm more impressed. Already I'm more impressed. So what they did with this gun is they made it a lot more accurate. And also they gave it less recoil. Fire rate is still the same, I believe. Nine fire rate, so it bleeds through builds. Yeah, you guys saw that. That, that I mean, that felt better. And it does more damage. Well, I, actually, I would say damage is comparable, right? Because this is 23 damage. It's gold rarity. We had a gold MK. Is it is it the same damage? I think it's still 23 at gold. Let's see how this thing performs in longer range. I know they made it to where guns that go into first shot go into first shot a little bit quicker, but this still seems kind of like slow for a first shot accuracy. Man, I just feel like the MK is going to win by default, man. I just feel like everyone's just going to like the people who like don't do the research or don't really know what's going on. They're just going to vote for the MK because they remember how powerful it was last season. And believe me, it was powerful last season, but this, this is a, this is a different gun, man. Dude, that's nice that's no red dot at all too that's like not even red dot that's just straight ads not first shot accuracy it has bloom but it's pretty minimal seems like the bloom is uh non-existent mark seven is good it's not it's not 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 with the burst in the game if it was the only red dot sure but the burst is just way way stronger like you really you can literally get way more knocks with the burst like before you have to reload than with the mk man wow it's a lot of damage i still feel like the burst is my favorite gun though i guess from this range i don't feel com comfortable if they have a, a burst and i don't oh wow what a jump Woo! he was going the distance man combat combat's a better gun it's the better vote, but it, it, it's still not a crazy good gun, but it's way more solid and, and practical. It's kind of like a medium range SMG, a medium long range SMG with like no builds. A lot of the fights are long range. So you need that. You need that scope, but you don't need the MK scope. You need you need a, you need the burst. You need the burst or the thermal for these long range fights. The MK7 and the combat are both very close range guns. The Ranger versus the MK? Ah, I don't know. I'm not a fan of the Ranger. I'll definitely take the uh, the combat and MK over the Ranger. Dude, everyone's hiding. It's actually crazy. I'm like looking for people, but everyone is missing right now. They're all hiding in tilted towers, tilted bowers. Get rid of the tires. Oh, we got a zipper. That is scary, man. Thoughts on the drummy? The drummy goes dummy. That's my thoughts. Okay, so we did that because we could. It's just it's a different ball game man it's a different ball game how we feel i feel great
screw it, right? I'm going to open this, bait him into peeking. Oh, God. Oh, God. He's got a combat and a drummy. No. GG's.